<laughs> what up? Everyone, this is everyone's favorite segment, the horse review. Horse review. This is the Easter celebration edition. So today's horse is going to be Easter themed. Um, so today we'll be watching a video called, uh, excuse me, pardon, excuse me, pardon. When a horse gets a visit from the Easter Bunny. Now we'll be checking this horse out, seeing what it's all about, and uh, hopefully it stacks up. Because that's what we're all here for, those high quality horses. Uh, this is Oatmeal McHorseman uh, coming at you live with the, the horse review. Dun, 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 dun. Um, yeah. So let's have a look at this, shall we? I'm just going to shrink down here for now. Get back to you, uh, equestrians. Is there sound? Doesn't seem like there's sound. Why is there no sound? What the fuck is this? This is creepy, dude. Why is it? Oh, it's so it's eerily quiet. Why is it so quiet? Are my headphones in? Yeah. Sounds up. What? It's just silent. Uh, oh my god, it's running a horse now. <laughs> Alright. Hmm. Wow. This is a big one. This is also probably going to be the, the quietest horse review. But this is definitely a big one. Don't mind all that. I'll just look. zero comments. <laughs> what should I write, gamers? I'll I'll give them the rating afterwards. I'll add it to the comments. Uh, okay, let's hope the, the, the description set. Whoa, it's a big description. Okay. Everyone wants to get a visit from the Easter Bunny, right? Well, my horse is no exception. It just so happens that the Easter Bunny did come and visit him. Exclamation point. Hope you enjoy. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter to you too, whoever you are. Um, then it starts shilling for something called News Flare. Uh, yep, that's about it. Anyway, so wow, a lot to unpack here. So at first it was creepy, but then it was it stopped being creepy and it just started to be um, wholesome. Um, let's just get a little frame by frame here going. So that's a, that was the Easter Bunny. Now what, I gotta make this clear, because I, oh yeah, I gotta make this very clear. This is an important point to make, because, um, I am a professional horse rater, emphasis on horse. I cannot include any um, influence from outside the horse realm uh, contestants um, such as this rat this uh, this rabbit so um, in my rating I have to consider the horse only 
uh, without the rabbit. Uh, it's only fair. It's what I've been doing um, this whole time because I'm a professional. Uh, so, I can, so yeah, so we can just ignore this rabbit right now. This is the horse. Now, notice something that's a little unique about this horse. It's got rabbit ears. Next to its normal ears, what? Oh my god, they got fucking hair in my eye, dude. It's gonna drive me insane. Hold on. Okay. It's got arms. <laughs> and it's feeding itself with its arms. That's a weird sight to behold. That's something you don't normally see in the horse world. Um, so... I mean, that's so avant-garde in the horse world that I don't even know what to rate it. On one hand, it is completely unorthodox. Um, it goes against all uh, uh, horse equestrian rating traditions. Um, it's almost slander in that regard. Uh, it also goes against, you know, just mother nature, dude. The horses don't have arms. So... But on the other hand, it is, it is very interesting. Um, usually horses don't have arms. It's kind of interesting to see. It kind of makes me relate to them a bit more. Um, but really, the rabbit ears are just interesting. It's a good, it's a good choice. Uh, so then, the, it meets the rabbit. Okay, so it, it knows how to shake hands. Now remember, we're not judging the rabbit. We're just looking at the horse shake hands here. And then he kind of looks away. Now, that's a kind of uh, an indicator of an untrained horse, unless that's a kind of a plot point, but I don't think it is. I'm just going to play it here. No, he just kind of looks away. That's that's a little bit of a point deduction. He, he, he's an untrained horse a little bit there. And then from here, it kind of just looks like home footage. Before it looked like a professional studio um, presentation, and then that happens, and then he starts riding the horse, and then you get the photos, and they're beautiful photos, I gotta say. Getting fed the, the, the carrot, obviously the Easter Bunny and his, oh my god, they're, they're like best friends. Anyway, um, let's have a look at this horse. Honestly, this is, I gotta tell you, equestrians, this is my most difficult horse review yet. I'm on, on the edge of my seat here. This is a hard one. This is going to, this, this is the horse review. Hang on, let me just make sure I'm recording here, because... I'm recording this. It, I gotta record myself here. This is the horse review that will define horse review. It is this horse review that will shape who I am as a reviewer. This is the big leagues, boy. Let's get in there, guys. We got a little bit more rating to do. Now, while I'm, uh, I don't even know how to lead into this. To be honest, this goes to show my uh, um, my my amateur nature, my, my amateurness in the field of reporting, but. Oh fuck. What was I gonna say? I tried to chuck some news flare into my speech, but then I just forgot what I was gonna say. Um Oh yeah. I had to mention the silence. Now I'm gonna read some comments just to make sure there's nothing funky going on, but the silence is weird. Oh that's right, there are no comments. Okay, 
Oh, this is fucking whack, dude. Let's just watch it. Like, remember, disregard the rabbit. And we're gonna watch this horse here. <laughs> this is a oh, wow. Shakes the hand. Well, I mean, there's a little. Okay, so there's a little bit of a points drop when you drop the carrot there. He wasn't. He's not. This. Okay, let, let's, we've firmly established that this horse isn't perfect. However, wow, this horse is amazing. Um, very next uh, generation horse. Next, uh, this is very avant garde horse. Um, I'm very excited about this horse. I think this could really redefine the future of horses. Guys, I think I feel. I think I, I think I, I think, wow, I know my, I know my rating now, guys. Is there a better shot of this horse? Maybe walking away, yeah, that's nice. That's a nice shot. This is my rating. It may come as a shock to some of you. This may be. This is going to be a very controversial rating, but I'm going to give this horse. I'm having last-minute doubts. There's going to be a moment for the judge to reconsider. I'm just going to watch this last part here. See, keeps you hanging on there. Gives a wave. And then it's got the photos as well. That's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Guys, this horse is a solid four out of five horses. Um, it's got. A really forward-thinking performance. Um, it's, it's a really good-looking horse. Um, it's really just next level, next generation. It is an advanced horse. Um, it does have some. Um, it's it's not a perfect five. It, it does have some um, uh, problematic points. Uh, I don't know what it what it was, but the uh, the silence is a bit of a strange artistic choice. Um, but there were some uh, mishaps throughout the performance which made it just, just not the perfect horse because uh, we do ch judge horses on how trained they are and this one's not, you know, fine-tuned enough, i got to say. Um, but i got to say this is one of the best horses I've seen so far. Um, besides maybe Mr. Ed. Is that his name? The horse is a horse is a horse guy. The horse is a horse, of course, of course. Mr. Ed. Yeah, he was the five. And he's what everyone has to fucking live up to. Anyway, that's a good horse. This is a good horse too. And I commend him on his uh, efforts. But yep, that's a definite four out of five horses for that guy. Um, so thanks for watching, guys. That's, that's, this is the Easter edition of the H horse review. Um, we just watched an Easter miracle just there. A beautiful horse. Uh, well deserved of its uh, score. Uh, it's not easy to get a good uh, horse review score here. You've seen um, some horses just get shut down completely and they just break down and they're sent off to the glue factory. Um, but this horse was good. So, thanks for watching, guys. Um, this is Captain Oates signing off. 
Um, Happy Easter. I think I'm going to play a game after this. It's 2 in the morning, but we'll see how we go. Uh, catch you later. Horse review.